everyone, Dr. David Clark here. I'm here to announce a brand new class with the Carrick Institute called Mastery of Male and Female Hormone Problems. And we're also going to include adrenal glands in that as well. What are we going to be covering? Well, we got three days to cover a lot of great information to help you reach out to people in your community and your practice and help women who are suffering with PCOS, endometriosis, infertility, menstrual irregularities, and miscarriages. There's plenty of women in your practice right now that are struggling with those things, and I'm going to be showing you during this three days how to recognize it, how to take physical exam findings to recognize these things, and talk about what tests you ought to be doing to find out what physiologically is wrong. Now, I'll, I'm going to stop there because if you know anything about uh, testing for hormone problems, you probably think, well, I'm going to do blood tests, right, or I'm going to do saliva tests. And the trick is, depending on what you want to do, there's different tests that you want to avoid. So one of the things I'll be doing during that weekend is telling you if a woman's taking hormones, do this test. If she's not taking hormones, do this test. If she has a regular cycle, do this test. I'm going to give you a nice little way of thinking about what test you ought to be doing in order to, to, to narrow down what's behind those problems. Now, I'll give you another little preview. Embedded in those female hormone problems are certain physiology because what it's not as simple as, guys, is saying, well, if a woman has uh, menstrual cramping, I'm going to give her black cohosh, right? Or if a guy has, uh, you know, problems with erectile dysfunction, I'm going to give him, uh, you know, uh, nitric oxide or horny goat weed. You know, you can see this stuff at GNC. It's a lot more complex than that because what I don't do is teach you give this supplement for this, you know, this symptom because that just doesn't work. What we're going to teach you to do is to master the understanding of the physiology behind these problems. So with women, we're covering those kinds of problems. And with men, we'll be talking about, obviously, testosterone. Now, again, it's not as simple as saying every guy that comes in feeling a little down and depressed when he's 45 and he's gaining a little weight that he needs testosterone. Way too many people in your community are taking hormones they don't need. And when you take a hormone you don't need, you can set off a chain reaction that can make you permanently dependent on the hormone. I want you to save people from that anti-aging clinic syndrome. With men, we're going to be talking about what happens to men's testosterone levels as they age and what problems occur. For example, we could be talking about oxidative damage to the testic uh, testicles. We can talk about autoimmunity to the testicular gland. We can talk about problems with aromatizing testosterone. I'm going to teach you how to recognize those things in men based on their symptoms, how to recognize it through the correct testing, and then I'm going to give you proven protocols that come straight out of the office on what to do for these people. So like all of my classes, we're going to have lots of cases where we can grapple with and learn this material so that you can go away on Monday morning and when a woman comes in and she says that she has an irregular period and she's got a little extra dark facial hair, you're going to go, oh, I know what that is, and you're going to know in your mind, I need to do this test and this test and here's the treatment I'm probably going to do. And you're going to, serve, you're going to bring a great service to these people by helping, helping them avoid hormones they don't need and helping them, let me just tell you, with some of these patients, you're going to help them get pregnant and have kids. And some of these women have been told they can't have kids. And some of these women have been to fertility clinics and they don't know what to do. You're going to be able to help some of these people have a child, which is an amazing gift to be able to be a part of. And for me, it's a very, it's a very emotional topic because I've had that happen in my practice. And I know there's people in your community that you could do the same for. So it's a three-day class. There's going to be online streaming. Make sure you sign up and get information about it. And I can't wait for you guys to come to our three-day class on mastery of male and female hormone problems.